Valentine's Day is a playground for a narcissistic person to play many manipulative psychological mind games to get one over other people. When it comes to a narcissist on Valentine's Day, it is their victory day. They are looking to win and as they like the empathy to care, they're looking to win at all costs to you. So when it comes to Valentine's Day, you can potentially be in the idolisation stage of a relationship where it is pretty easy for them to go into a shop and pick up a card or order one online and find out the things that you like or look at what their ex is like and sell you that illusion that you're going to have a lovely life together. They can whisk you off on extravagant holidays if they've got the money to do so, to lull you into that false sense of security, to so tell you that illusion, that belief of what life will be like with them. They're not going to be honest and say, yeah, I'm not particularly keen on Valentine's Day. It's a bit too commercialised. When someone's honest, you know where you stand with them. And then if you try to change them, you're being the manipulative one. If you then recognise that you either do or don't have the same opinion, you can take the relationship forward. They make you believe they've got the same sort of beliefs and thoughts and values as you. And then once they've got you where they want you, they begin to devalue you. They change the game on you. This is when they tell you that you don't need to bother with gifts. You know that they love you. So they raise your expectations to lower your standards, yet they get you to feel bad by claiming that they've had a long day. Why can't you just appreciate them? They've spent all the day at work. They've spent all the day at home with the children. And they slowly break you down into feeling like you can't speak up for yourself. And then they will go and idolise somebody new. They will replace you right before they discard you. And they will discard you on Valentine's Day or around Valentine's Day in some of the most horrific ways. They might just start an argument. They might do something that they know irritates you. And once you go and speak to them, they get offended and say, I don't know why I bother. And that's their excuse to then not bother and love somebody new and then they're going to plaster that new relationship all over social media to get at you and to woo the new supply. They also use Valentine's Day to hoover when they send you messages of things you did together to get you reminiscing, sending you those gifts again, asking you how you are, sending you that card because they want to suck you back into their games, to treat you like dirt, to discard you all over again. It's a pattern of behaviour with narcissistic people that they rinse and repeat no matter who they are with. When it comes to Valentine's Day, go and treat yourself as you deserve to be treated well.